Greetings one y'all. Welcome to Dog Pound NASCAR. This is your host John Forson speaking. What a great day. Strategy. Defendants. Who came up on top? John Henry Chip Nemechek. Once again, gets his fourth rank. Congratulations. Jeff Perry. This is his best track and he got wiped out. So, um, not looking too good for Josh Bear, but, I mean, he's good. He comes from a short track background, so, Stu Haas needs to, uh, start. If, if, I'm going to say this, if. Elk Omara retires. The knee look John Hurst knee check way. Yes, he came from his dad, Front Row Joe, back in my day. But he built his own legend. So, I mean, town comes from everywhere. Toy Story. So. Could Nimichek go for Ford and uh, be the 10 car and be the leadership role? Who knows? It's in Tony Stewart and Gene Haas' name. I'm just here. I'm just stating the facts. Yes, he came from Front Row Joe, his dad, but he came from, he went through trucks, went through Xfinity, is, is now Xfinity, and he's 35 years old, an older driver, somebody that you want to put in your car. And he has sponsorship and funding. Think about it. Can can Ford steal John Harney check or can Ford and Tony Stewart and Gene Haas steal John Harney check from Toyota? Because Toyota is backed too much. They got Corey Heim ready to go. They got Sammy Smith ready to go. They got Ryan Truex. All too many. Can Ford steal one Toyota? question is who I know who John Hunter Nemechek deserves a ride in the 10 car if Eric Elmo retires I know you're looking at back Michael McDowell yes he's a good driver he's in the Ford you're looking at Sammy Smith yes he's Coming up, but in truck, but and that's a big burden in contracts. So I mean, Stuart Haas, start listening up. That's all I gotta say. Uh, bye.